Hello guys, today I wanted to show you how to properly diagnose on the ultrasound guidance and look at the infraspinatus of the shoulder and also in the same image we could look at the posterior glenohumeral joint. Sometimes we could also see a portion of the labrum uh, with the same uh, approach. So depending on the patient that you have, you could use a linear probe or you could use a curvilinear probe. I have a very muscular patient with me so I'm going to be using a curvilinear uh, probe. I have already changed my settings to maximize my image. So what you want to do is you want to approach them from the posterior aspect and we are going to unfreeze my image. And at this point, we are, what we, what we want to find is the humeral head. <clears throat> at this point then, I'm going to make sure my image is a little bit nicer and humeral head at this point, we could actually see the glenoid and a portion of my labrum. The infraspinatus tendons are going to be right in here. One easy thing that you could do to help you uh, identify the structures a little bit more is to get a patient's hand and externally and in internally rotate. And at this level, we could actually see the infraspinatus a little bit better, nice fibrillar structure, just like any other tendon would. And we could dynamically stress the elbow or where we could see a um, couple of things. We already talked about the infraspinatus. Now I'm gonna concentrate and look at the uh, labrum. We could see a portion of that nice triangular structure. Uh, Roger, rotate your hand, please, and keep on doing it. We could kind of get a good visualization of that, make sure we wig whack the probe to get a better uh, image. If there's any fluid or, or um, effusion of the glenohumeral joint, we could also see that there. Um, sometimes if there's been a prior dislocation, we could see a, a hill sac deformity as well. Well, using this approach is an easy, quick assessment of the posterior glenohumeral joint and also visualizing the infraspinatus. Thank you very much. Hope you guys enjoy the video.